Dreamers! I'm Sarah Lee. This is SingingTV.com. Together, you and I, we're making singing simple. And today's topic of discussion is what does the phrase muscle memory mean? We hear it a lot, and it's one of those phrases that can be kind of confounding or confusing, and so I want to talk about it. Because what we really mean when we talk about muscle memory is actually muscle coordination. For example, there's no memory in our muscles. Our muscles don't have brains. They can't actually literally remember anything, right? There's no little brain in every one of my muscles. Rather, what we mean when we see, say muscle memory is that we're coordinating our muscles with our brain. Because everything that we do with our physical body comes from our, base, our brain first. I want to walk. My brain says to my body, walk, and my body makes it happen. Um, so picture something like this. If I'm a grown adult and I want to jump two feet forward, I can go ahead and do that. Or jump back. I don't have to think about it. I'm not thinking, okay, how much do I weigh? What's the angle at which I have to go? How much do I have to do? I don't have to think any about that. There's no signs or cosines going on in my brain in terms of angles and all that kind of stuff, right? I just think, boom, go. The reason I do that is because I've jumped enough times in my lifetime and have developed enough hand-eye coordination over time to be able to jump there. If you looked at a one and a half year old or a two year old who's just learned to walk and see you know, how coordinated they are, it takes them time. Only over time will their brains say, do this, and the muscles can actually coordinate with the brain. So the same thing uh, you know, is true if we're trying to coordinate to saying something that's hard. What's hard? Hey! Something like that. Or an exercise in episode 21. Ooh. I very often hear people try to do that exercise and it sounds more like Ooh. You get the first note, you get the last note, but the notes in between don't work. Or riffs and runs instead of hey, it sounds like hey. There's not a real, um, there's not a real coordination there. So, what do we have to do? We have to slow them way down. Ooh, or even slower than that. Let's try. Ooh, just trying that, and then up a half step with a metro, a metronome. is something that you can do. So at whatever pace or whatever speed you can sing it, so you're individually hearing the notes, that's where you should sing it. You should practice that for a while, a day, two days, a week, two weeks, however long it takes you to really master that. And only then can you speed up the metronome. So instead of ooh, it might be Eventually, speed up incrementally so you can get ooh, 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 or ooh, ooh, <laughs> ooh, 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 and eventually, hey, yeah, those kinds of things. We really got to start slowly so that we can coordinate. Our brain says, body, do this. Body goes, okay, let me try that. Muscles have to work. They have to learn how to coordinate with what the brain wants. And the reason we have to do that is we have to start slowly. So you hear a lot of people talking about muscle memory and what that means. Get it under your fingers. You know, let me work that out for a minute and get into my muscle memory. What we really mean when we say muscle memory is muscle coordination. So I hope that that clears up the phrase uh, and that you understand when we talk about muscle memory, what we may really mean is coordination. And in order to get our muscles to coordinate with what the brain wants it to do, we've got to start slow and then speed it up. We talk a lot about this in practicing in, upper ep in other episodes, and I kind of wanted you to know, you know, what's the reason behind why I tell you to start slow? Why can't I just go from here to here? Well, 
it's not the way the body works. It's not the way the body can really coordinate with the brain. So that's what we mean when we say muscle memory. We really mean this muscle coordination. I hope that clears that up. And I hope you'll follow Singing TV at Twitter, at Singing TV. You can follow us on Facebook, again, Singing TV. Um, post your comments here on YouTube, email, tweet us, all that kind of stuff. And um, if you have other topics, questions that you want answered, hope you'll do that. Again, I'm Sarah Lee. This is SingingTV.com. Together you and I, we're making singing simple.